Hi friends, welcome to the tutorial of Computer Graphics Programming. Today we are going to study about the viewport and clipping. Uh, what is viewport? Uh, actually, in computer graphics, we are studying about two, th uh, two terms. One is called as window, and second is called as viewport. Window meaning is uh, uh, what to display, and viewport meaning is where to display. So uh, today we are going to study about the viewport. We are having the viewport function in which uh, you can use to display the object in different different uh, spaces with from where the, uh, different different spaces you can uh, display the object. So let us start. We are having uh, one old example that is called as face dot that. Uh, we are having one face file that is uh, we have already discussed in the previous tutorial. Uh, in this one, we are having different. De uh, we are uh, developing the face with the help of uh, different polygon or line strip function we have used here. Uh, so uh, this is about the face. Uh, you can study this one from the previous tutorial. We are using the data from the uh, file system, and uh, this is the face we want to display on the screen. Uh, one face we are displaying, and another face we are using viewport to viewport the. Uh, different images. So the code is given in the description. You can download the code and uh, you can just copy the code from there. Other things are seen from the previous tutorial description that is we are using f string because we are calling the uh, data from the file and uh, we are using namespace std sometimes uh, because uh, this is C++ file we need to call using namespace std for the file function and this is uh, the remaining things are seen that we are calling the polygon number of the polygon and then we are calling the line history function line history function what is line history function that it will uh, connect the last line to the first line so uh, previous line that is in continuum, uh, continuous fashion so we will get uh, one polygon type of the shape and uh, we are calling the display function in the display function uh, other things uh, we are using here you can give the value to so it will be more clearer and uh, uh, this is our projection window we are using this projection window the main projection window other thing we are calling GL viewport uh, for the uh, display the images if you will see GL viewport it is using X minimum X maximum uh, Y minimum and Y maximum this is for the two dimensional uh, viewport uh, it is X Y direction uh, and we are calling the function draw outline Okay, the main function uh, where we have uh, drawn our image and we are calling this function uh, and we are calling another viewport here GL viewport uh, the X minimum Y minimum value uh, uh, and uh, X maximum and Y maximum value and we are calling it again this is for the two dimensional uh, viewport uh, and other things are same uh, now uh, just copy the code from here and go to the visual studio uh, go to new project, start new project, select empty project, click on viewport, right click on your project name, go to add button, new item, select C++ file, here uh, you can give this, uh, some name of the file, add the file and paste the code here. Okay, and now we need to provide the different uh, dependencies. Go to C, C++, general time, additional include directories. We need to include the header files. Click on the button. Go to your Dwat and Glue folder. Dwat and Glue folder, uh, you can uh, download from the internet or uh, you can see the first tutorial uh, where you can, uh, link is given, you can download the Dwat and Glue folder. Click on OK button. Now go to linker tab, go to general tab, additional library directory. We need to copy the additional library files. Go to desktop, dot and queue, library, select folder, dot and queue, library, select folder. OK. Go to input tab, additional dependencies. Free dot dot lib blue thirty two dot lib. Click on OK button. Apply. Okay. Uh, one thing is remaining that is uh, uh, this 
phase.dat file what we have saved where you, uh, our uh, data is there just copy this one go to your uh, folder right click on the project name open folder in windows explorer paste to your file here and the uh, remaining thing is that uh, we need to copy the glut and glue dll file go to glut and glue folder copy these two files and go to your project name right click on your project go to open folder in windows explorer paste to the two files here now everything is set now you can call the or your you can debug the your program just click on the debug build a solution and then it will debug so this is the output we have called the our original window uh, you can see the first uh, orthographic projection that is for the 150 450 100 and 400 and uh, this one is for the second uh, viewport the first viewport this is for the second this is for the third viewport we are having three images from the uh, same file so this is about the uh, viewport projection uh, thank you uh, very much for watching the video please subscribe the channel for more videos the source code is free you can download from the description uh, thank you once again please subscribe the channel for more videos this is a complete tutorial series in computer graphics programming and open gl for the beginners